Hello everyone, my name is Zachary Green and I am a senior at Riverside Poly High School. I'm doing the Senior Capstone Project and for those of you who don't know, it's a project that displays our lives and things that are important to students like myself and we have to pick a problem, something that hasn't really been resolved yet, but how would we resolve it ourselves? So that's where I've done so much thinking and so much delving and diving, and I finally came up with it. The problem I'm presenting is stigmatisms towards junior colleges. And there's so many negative line lights nowadays towards these schools, and they're just not given the right amount of credit or the right amount of limelight that they should be getting. Um, I'm doing this project. It may bring offense to some. It may enlighten others. But the one thing I really hope to get out of this is to inform. I'd love to inform you, the audience, about all of your options because, like myself, there are hundreds of thousands of seniors in the United States and they're going through the same exact thing that I'm going through. The college application project, the, um, the waiting to hear back from the schools, the stressing about the SAT, ACT, getting into that school. It's a horrid process that in the end could all be avoided for something that is much greater and can lead to better things. So that's really my, um, that's my thesis. But um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to be traveling all across the Central Coast and Central and Southern California to look at some of the best junior colleges and see, I'm going to be traveling to some of the best junior colleges to see what makes them great, or to just enlighten you and show you that these schools are friendly places that all students can go to instead of spending hundreds of thousands of dollars on the first two years of a college education. I'm going to be using my GoPro to record everything along the way. The end game of this whole entire project is to create a documentary. Um, a big compilation of all the videos and all the information I've gathered from going to these schools and visiting and in turn just bringing light on the subject of junior colleges getting rid of some of the stigmatisms that are perceived about them and some of the myths that lie behind them like getting stuck there for multiple years because there's an easy fix so that you're out in two years or less this journey, it's going to take a few months to complete, but I hope at the end that I come to a new conclusion or am enlightened by something that I find. Um, as of right now, I've been accepted to six universities and I've been denied by six. And it was a hard process, but I'm enlightened. But I have a junior college in my mind that I think will do wonders for me, but I want to weigh out all my options and see everything that every school has to offer me. So this journey is going to take a while, but I hope that you, the audience, will go through it with me and will be enlightened by the things that I discover, or you might not be. You may protest it. However, the fact that the information is given to you, I think that's the greatest power of all. Because with information comes power. So, thank you. Mm -hmm.